Hello, and welcome to our lesson on algebraic proof. So we're going to prove several number properties using the rules of algebra. We'll begin with question A, where we're going to show the sum of a plus b squared and a minus b squared is always an even number. To do this, we're going to expand a plus b squared. So we have a plus b, lots of a plus b, and we're going to add it because of this word here, which is sum to a minus b squared, which will expand a minus b, lots of a minus b. We can expand these pairs here. So we have a squared plus ab plus another ab plus b squared. And we're going to add this to these pair here, which will expand. Again, we have a squared. Now we have negative AB and another negative AB. A negative times a negative is a positive, so it's B squared. And now we can collect the like terms where we have a squared plus 2AB plus B squared plus another A squared. And this is minus 2ab and b squared here. And now you can see the positive 2ab will cancel with a negative 2ab. So these will go. And then we have 2a squared and 2b squared. We can factorize this by taking out the 2. So we have 2 lots of a squared plus b squared. And any multiple of two is by definition an even number. So that's our proof. Okay, do you want to try and prove question B? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So we'll begin by expanding y plus six squared. So we have y squared plus six y plus another six y plus 36. And for y plus 2 squared, we have y plus 2 and y plus 2, which is y squared plus 2y and another 2y plus 4. But this negative here means we need to multiply all of this out again with a negative. So we can rewrite this as y squared plus 12y plus 36 which is this, minus the y squared minus 4y minus 4. You can see the y squared and the negative y squared will cancel. 12y take away 4y is 8y, and 36 take away 4 is 32. We can factorize this expression by taking out the 8. So we have 8 lots of y plus 4. And anything multiplied by 8 is by definition a multiple of 8. Okay, do you want to try and solve question C? The key word here is difference, so think carefully about what that might mean. You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. Okay, for question C, the word difference means subtract, so here's a subtraction. I'm going to expand out 2n plus 1, so we have 4n squared plus 2n plus another 2n plus 1. And I'm going to multiply out the 2n plus 1 with a negative. So we have negative 2n and negative 1. I'll collect the like terms. So we have 4n squared. This 2n will cancel with this negative 2n. So we have 1 left. 1 take away 1 will make 0. So it simplifies to mean this. I can factorize it by taking out a 2. So we have two lots of 2n squared plus n. And again, any multiple of 2 is by definition even. Okay, thank you very much for watching, and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again, and take care.